hello guys so today requirement is I have a string array so uh, the this array I want to uh, post uh, to my uh, control controller so I have a service here the empty service so I need to accept uh, this array as a parameter and I need to do some operation uh, so uh, how to get this array uh, to the action of a controller uh, by a jQuery is a today's topic. So here I going to take a Jax post post call uh, to achieve that. Okay. Uh, so fine. Uh, before that, uh, so this array I need to convert as a parameter. For that, what I going to do? I going to add like uh, the meaningful name called post data. So this is my post data. So post data have a parameter values. That values I going to pass this. Uh, a list uh, set of array so this is the array object parameter the value contain the string of array so now I going to write my Ajax call so for that I already built my Ajax uh, function how to post so normally you guys uh, know that how to form the Ajax so by using the dollar symbol and you need to mention what type of Ajax it's a post method and the URL URL you need to mention the home controller and the service and you need to mention the data as a, a parameter what are the parameter that you need to post so uh, I have the form the post uh, data that I am pushing uh, to my data so in the and say the post data I have the parameter called value so on success I going to alert that so here I going to accept my value parameter so this is a uh, array so uh, I will going to accept uh, in a list so list of using a collection so if you list if you're not able to find uh, you you have to add the namespace called generic collections so that I uh, added uh, the system dot collections so under the collection only we have the list okay so this uh, uh, parameter solves a string so the parameter name is values that I mentioned in the jQuery so this is the parameter values the values contain the list of uh, array object so anyways we can uh, take it from the list here so fine so anyways uh, okay I'll uh, just cre keep the breakpoint here so I will check uh, whether I value I got whatever the values that I um, uh, add, uh, added from uh, us, uh, in this array whatever the value that I have I, I need to check whether it is uh, passing correctly or not so let me go and run now my application we'll see how the things is work so this method this function I need to call uh, on page load only okay I'm just calling this function in a page load okay what I did uh, so I have array so that array uh, I want to uh, uh, create a model so this is a post mo post data as a model so here you can uh, mention the multiple parameter by separating the comma so normally how the model works the same thing I just push uh, the parameter values the string array so that uh, values it's accepting here so so that's what actually the mean uh, of uh, the post data so it's not uh, mm, uh, things that uh, getting uh, complex or confusing it's a model this is like uh, one post data class I have uh, 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 added like a multiple property kind of the values one of the property so the same same way the uh, jQuery works like this so let my application build we'll see how the things is working so this I added in my direct index home controller only okay my application is built out my breakpoint is hit out so I'm in a home page now so we'll check the value yes we have three counts item one two three so this is what the value that I'm pushing from um, front end uh, through jQuery so we got the value so anyways uh, now the result is success okay so let me continue yes it's alerting me the success because I default uh, ask uh, what is the result uh, that value uh, if once the we got a success uh, that data is posted successfully 
uh, it will return me the uh, the written data data dot result that I uh, get from here so hope you understand so this is the way to post the array to the controller uh, by using the Ajax of uh, jQuery so thanks for watching the video guys you should add uh, um, before doing all the stuffs uh, you should ha add a, a library to enable the jQuery if you're facing any issue like uh, dollar symbol is not found something like that because yes you need to include the jQuery library to build the jQuery functions so thanks for watching the video guys if you're new to jQuery just to follow what what is the uh, stuff this is the way to build the uh, post method so uh, I explained shortly that uh, yes it's Ajax post call it's a type and the URL data and on success and this is a type uh, what is the type you're going to um, post is the data it's a JSON type JSON so traditionally is uh, true yes that's what so hopes it's a very simple tutorial you guys can find and uh, get the benefit of this if you have any doubt queries please comment us please subscribe our channel if you want to uh, get a more uh, regular updates